They were underdogs, but they challenged an empire. They won their rights, and they changed the fate of nations. This is a chance to show the British without having to hit them, to show them that we stand for something. We are not just slaves. They were nonviolent, but they were not passive. Unfortunately, the concept of nonviolence for many people is that you get hit on one cheek, you turn the other cheek, you don't do anything. But nonviolence means fighting back. When the laws were unjust, they disobeyed. Our management does not allow us to serve niggers in here. They knew the price would be high, and they were ready to pay it. Violence has a very simple dynamic. I make you suffer more than I suffer. That's what a war is. The difference with nonviolence is we don't want to beat the opponent up. We don't think that does any good. We cannot go on with this situation. Instead of making bombs, they strategized. They organized. They resisted. They boycotted. They went to jail. It's mass action. And, and what do you do? You can't shoot all these people. You can't lock them all up. They were feeling us coming. And we knew then that we got apartheid in a crisis. They believed they possessed a force more powerful than their oppressors. And they were right. 